Hello, Jake here today. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get root access to your Galaxy S3 9300. So first you're going to need to power down your phone. Once your phone's powered down, you're going to need to turn it back on while holding the volume down key, the center button, and also the power button. So hold them all down and power on your device. And then you'll get this warning, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, you want to press the up key. That's to continue. So as you see, up key. And now you'll be met with downloading mode. Do not turn off the target. So make sure that you've got charge in your phone to do this too, guys. Don't do it on an empty battery. Plug in your USB cable to your computer. Then you'll need to turn on Odin, like start Odin. And as you'll see, it's connected through COM1. Now, you will also want to select a PDA and open CF root tar file, which the downloads for Odin and also the CF root tar file are in the description. And now you see it's downloading this stuff. It's downloaded. Now it's doing the recovery in the cache. See on the right, it's doing its little thing and you'll get a green thing indicating that it's completed. And your phone will do this. Now these download links are for the Galaxy S3 i9300 version. If you're using a different version, make sure you have the right software for that version, which there's plenty of stuff in forums and everything. And as you see, it's just going down, rebooting. It's gone through all its thing. Now it'll reboot to the normal Galaxy screen and you'll need to use an app called Root Checker to check that you have root access now. So the link for root check is in the description as well for the app. Just click on it and download it to your phone. Now you need root access to install custom ROMs, which I'll show you how to install a custom ROM in another video. And I'll put the link right here if you look down. Now see root checker app, select that. Verify root access. It always seems to come up with this message. I don't know why it just does. Congratulations, your device now has root access. So, that's good. Now don't forget, like and subscribe to see more videos. And leave a comment. Tell us what you've done with your rooted phone what custom ROMs you've got on, and all of the other sort of stuff that you're doing with your rooted Android phones. Okay, see ya.